Where is the last crystal? That is a mystery for the ages. What on earth? I don't know what happened there. We don't need to go in there. That's where the divine fire or whatever was. No. No. I'm on Slytherakai. Goblins? Camped uh, at the base of the east wall. They watch you warily as you approach. There are not so many of them as they aren't, w and they aren't well armed. They also don't seem to want to fight. Whatever. Goblins can camp, I guess. No law against them if they're obeying the laws. Cows, go away. Jeez. No, that's not a thing. Hmm. Herbs for healing potions. Josiah got a bunch of healing herbs for some reason. Pass those to Andrea. No. 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 Jeez. Go away. Did I ever go in there? I can't recall if I did, but I can do so now that I'm thinking of it. small serene underground lake here. On its shore is a small shrine. There is nobody here and the shrine seems to have been abandoned. Search it. Shrine apparently has been abandoned for several years. There is no sign of combat, fortunately. The altar is bare. And there is little more than broken seats and trash. However, in a side alcove you find a large beautiful quartz crystal. Sweet! I found them all! I don't even remember where I found them all, but I found the last two. Sigh. Freaking swamp, do I am so sick of it. Just want to take a shovel to it all and throw it into the river. Okay, come on, try to attack me so I can say no. Also, where am I going? The sight before you takes your breath away. This large hidden cave is filled with... Flawless quartz crystals covering the floor and walls. I've read this before, but I'm going to read it again. They catch the light, your light, and reflect it back in a blinding rainbow. The crystals hum and vibrate gently. The sound and motion is almost, but not quite soothing. It's not hard to figure out what the problem is. Near the cave entrance, vandals have broken off a bunch of the crystals. The damage is interfering with the soothing effect of the crystal vibrations. Let's repair the damage. You carefully fit the six crystals back into their places. As you watch, the cracks repair themselves, and the broken crystals become one with the cavern. The vibrations turn soothing and the energize and energizing in a sudden, powerful burst. You start to feel much stronger. Then, after reaching a powerful crescendo, the energy dies down, settling at a level that is merely pleasant. 
In the initial burst, the crystals had a beneficial effect upon you. You all gain experience. Woo! <laughs> ah, that was so worth it. Did that increase our stats? I can't remember. Did he have 12 strength? Didn't increase endurance or intelligence. Anyway. Let's head back to, uh... This. And see if I can't use the Orb of Vothralni to negotiate the lava down the road here. Probably not. Because crap like that happens. Save the game. Do do do. Ceiling too low. Aww. Not lava. Oh. Making me double step. Did it again. No. So what the heck is this? The Shattered Fort. Standing at the lowest point in a twisted, shattered landscape near a turbulent pool of lava, looking up you see an awesome sight. This huge cave once contained a huge fort, a mighty edifice of basalt. Then somehow it was shattered. Spires of ruined wall emerged from the smoldering volcanic rock below. Hideous pillars are barely visible through the suit. This is probably too tough for me. But you never know. place like this, it either... Look, guys. Oh, man, I didn't get arrows. place like this either has uh, safe walking level 3 or it does not. <laughs> and it, you're either expected to have it when you come in here or you find it here. Strange ancient runes carved on every surface of this ancient altar. You get a strange twitchy feeling as you stare at them. Let's leave it for a second. Save the game as a backup. 
Try to decipher it. The runes form disturbing pictographs and twisted words in an unfamiliar alphabet. As you examine them, you find that the patterns are very hypnotic. Soon all of you are bent close to the altar, staring at it. Eventually you pull yourselves away, looking at the seat. Carvings made you feel ill for a moment, you, you, like you had vertigo. The feeling has passed, though, and you, now you feel energized. Neat. Ow. 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 Piece of crap, you know that. <sighs> Can't believe I forgot to buy some freaking arrows. Hey, a bunch of undead. Better to get rid of them here. I don't think I can actually finish this area right now. As I recall, there's something you need to do elsewhere. Look guys, you're not cute, you're not funny. You're just obnoxious. Hello, cretin. Get out of here. that working out for you? As expected. There's a large cave wood wheel here with a long length of iron chain wrapped around it going into a hole. Turn the wheel! As far as you can tell, nothing happens. Oh boy. Freaking create illusions.
Got one. Where the heck did you come from, you frickin' respawn? Running, freaking coward. There you are. I knew if I called you out. sick of those stupid things. Summon illusions. You'll never get old, except that you did after the third time. Of course, you, as a NPC, have unlimited MP, and I, as a player character, have 